Tyler Hero definitely puts the heat in Miami with all his fire purchases. From crazy cars to million dollar mansions, you won't believe what this rising star owns. This brother's on another level right now. For one, the 23 year old made sure to start the 2023 year off right by purchasing a new South Florida mansion in January. The young bucket even set a new real estate record with his purchase as he dropped $10.5 million in one of Miami-Dade County's wealthiest neighborhoods, Pinecrest. Pinecrest is a location in the mix of Miami's finest attractions from top schools, high-end dining, shopping centers, and parks. There are apparently only eight other properties in that area that have sold for $8 million or up. Before buying his mansion, Tyler lived in an apartment that cost him $5,000 a month for rent and utilities. He has stepped it up even more with his new estate. You know Hero's crib gotta be lit. It's an entire 9,505 square feet with eight bedrooms and eight and a half bathrooms. His luxury house was pretty newly built in 2021 and has a bunch of amenities any pro ball player would love. It's a wine cellar, a gourmet chef's kitchen, a media room, and more. The modern home even has marble, stone, and wood that have been imported from Brazil and Italy. Now that's different. Build different, dog. We build different. But let's not forget this is the 305, so of course Tyler even has a swimming pool and a patio with cabanas along with a summer kitchen. Speaking of kitchen, he also has his own private chef that costs him about $20,000 a year. He be eating good. He's truly living it up, especially in the off season, I can only imagine. He can't relax just yet though. Are you not happy or you're only half happy or? Still to be happy about, job's not finished. Job finish? I don't think so. This year, the guard is pretty occupied with postseason playoffs. During the regular season, Hero averaged 20.1 points, 5.4 rebounds, and 4.2 assists per game. Hero and the Heat made it to the finals in 2020, and they're back at it again this year. Have a ring in mind as their final goal. <sighs> oh my god. Uh, it's not a failure, it's steps to success. Last year, after receiving the NBA's Sixth Man of the Year award, Hero signed a four-year, $130 million contract extension with Miami. His star performance has also earned him a sneaker multi-year endorsement deal with Nike during his rookie year. He was just 19 years old at the time, so you know he had big things in store. Miami is a city that has a lot of flair, and so does Tyler. The young star has apparently spent thousands just on custom paintings. He met an artist in Denver who painted a portrait of him from middle school, high school, college, and the NBA over the years. Jack, I want you to draw me like one of your French girls. Imagine how cool it would be to add to that painting of Tyler with an NBA championship trophy. Do you think it could happen in a few years? On and off the court, there is no doubt that Hero keeps it P. With his expenses, you can tell he spends a good amount on his clothes to look as fresh as he does. After all, he did receive Sports Illustrated Best Dressed Athlete Award in 2021. Tyler Hero! It's my first time really um, accepting the award, so it's about damn time. From wearing Louis Vuitton to Armani fragrances, style is a top priority for him. The young star likes to go to South Beach and Design District to hit up some of his favorite stores like Dior. Tyler eats out a lot in the city as well, with some of his favorite restaurants being Prime 112. The night after he got drafted, he even did a big celebration dinner with all of his friends and family. Over the course of one year, he said he spends around $10,000 on eating out. Food is one thing and clothes are another. He's spent around $85,000 just on clothes when first entering the league. And since he does live in sunny Miami, he loves a good pair of designer sunglasses and has at least 10 pairs now that have cost him around $10,000 in total. Hero even has a stylist he works with during the season to stay on top of his game. He stated before that one big splurge item he must have is a watch. Tyler was gifted a two-tone paddock for his birthday one year. You already know he had to get an icy chain to match the paddock too. He bought a custom Cuban chain from a jeweler, Iceman Nick, 
in Houston, which costed him $30,000. Another must-have of his is a car or two. Tyler has a Mercedes-Benz S-Class S63 AMG, which costed him $200,000. The luxury car, of course, has an elite sound system, seat massagers, and heated seats. He apparently bought the whip in Kentucky and then sent it down to Miami. Even though it was a big chunk of money, Hero said he had to pay just $300 to get the windows tinted. Next in his car collection, Tyler got a customized four-door Jeep Wrangler, which cost around $60,000. It's the perfect whip to drive around Miami, especially with the ability to take the top off. He rides in style. Even with all his car purchases for himself, the young star also kept his parents in mind. He had to make sure his parents were taken care of too. He bought his mom a Porsche for $80,000 and his dad a GMC truck for $40,000. One of Tyler's first big purchases apparently went towards gifting his mom a Gucci purse for $5,000 too. Tyler has nice taste and uses his money to experience the finer things in life. In years past, Tyler has had big vacations, or should I say vacations, with his model girlfriend Katia Elise Henry. Since they started dating in 2020, the couple now has two kids together. Congrats on having your second kid. I got, I know. Woo, That's gotta be baby. dope. That's gotta be dope. That's gotta be dope. Not for sure. Is it life changing? No, it is. It's a blessing. So if you don't have a name already, for, for the sun, we we so it. it's probably the like you gotta go with it. You have we to. we brainstormed for like a little bit last night. Five seconds. And Julia came up with it. You wanna present it? Can I get a drum roll? <laughs> First name, well obviously last name hero. First name super. Super. Superhero. Yeah. You know what? We we've, we've never thought of that. <laughs> <laughs> After the 2020 finals, him and his girl hit up Turks and Caicos for a nice little getaway. Beyond the tropical trips, Tyler makes sure his girlfriend is just as icy and fresh as him too. He got her a diamond encrusted necklace two years back along with gifts including a Christian Dior purse, Dior sunglasses, and Louis Vuitton heels. The necklace has a heart and a number 14 which of course is Tyler's jersey number. Fast forward to this season, Tyler did another trip to Turks and Caicos but with teammate Jimmy Butler this time. The two hopped on a plane right in between preseason and a season tip-off game. Now that's how you know you got it like that. I can't swim, so I, I, I can't no swim reason. either. You can't swim? Uh -uh. Oh, you got hood tendencies, man. Yeah. You would run with us. Give me some. <laughs> <laughs> Before the big leagues, Tyler was a college athlete at the University of Kentucky. The young Hooper would spend some time and money buying clothes and doing things around the small town, but the landscape looks a lot different now that he's in the NBA. Tyler originally signed a rookie deal for $3.6 million his first year in the league. With the money he's accumulated, he's been able to splurge, stack, spend, save, and also take care of his family, which is something he's always wanted to do. As a youngster in this league, Tyler only has more time to level up on the court, which means more time to live out this lavish lifestyle. Who knows what he is going to buy next?